Welcome to Maryland's Digital eLibrary Consortium, your library's virtual branch, where you can download thousands of ebook titles for free with your Maryland Library card. Books check out for up to 21 days for the Kindle, and there is a limit of six checkouts per customer. Here is some basic information about checking out ebooks from the library for your Kindle. Now we will learn how to find books for Kindle from Maryland's Digital eLibrary Consortium. The first thing you should do when you arrive at the Consortium website is sign in. This will allow you to see the Advantage titles available in your region as well as the titles that are available from the statewide collection. Click Sign In at the top of the screen. On the Sign In screen, shown here, you will be prompted to choose your library in this case Allegheny County Library System. Next, type in your 14-digit library card number with no spaces between the numbers. Finally, type in your PIN and click Sign In. One of the easiest ways to find Kindle books is to browse by one of the subject categories in the eBook lists at the top of the page. Click View More if the type of book you like doesn't show on this list. A better way to search for Kindle books is Advanced Search. Click Advanced Search at the top of the screen. The Advanced Search page, shown here, enables users to narrow search results to Kindle books as a format. You can also narrow the results by subjects. This will allow you to look for books in a particular genre, like westerns or mysteries. Or you can pick a broader category, like fiction or nonfiction. The checkbox for only show titles with copies available can be selected so that the results list will include only the Kindle books that are able to be checked out immediately. Leave this box unchecked if you wish to see all results, regardless of availability. In this way, you would be able to place a hold for items currently checked out to other library customers. When you've made your choices, click the search button. Regardless of which method you use to find books, it is easy to check out and download a book to your Kindle. Once you see a book you would like to read, click on its cover or title to select it. For this example, I have selected Sense and Sensibility by Jane Austen. Now click Borrow. The ebook is now checked out to you. The Borrow button has changed to Go to Bookshelf. Click that button now to begin downloading the ebook. If you check this book out by mistake, click Return Title to return it without downloading it. Once you have downloaded it, this option will disappear. If you have a stable internet connection, you could also click Read in your browser to open and read the book on your screen without downloading it. To download the book, click Download Select One Format, choose Kindle Book from the options that appear, and click to confirm your choice and download the book. This will open the Amazon.com website in a separate window or tab on your internet browser. If you checked out the book by mistake, you have another opportunity to return this book now. To download it to your Kindle, click Get Library Book. If you are not already logged in to your Amazon.com account, you will be prompted to do so. If you have multiple devices registered to your Amazon account, you can change the Deliver To option to send it to the device of your choice, whether to a Kindle e-reader or to the Kindle app on a device such as an iPod or iPad. You can also read the book in your browser using the Kindle Cloud Reader. Click on the Continue button to download the book. A confirmation message will show on screen. If you have a Wi-Fi connection, you're finished. The book will appear on your Kindle the next time it syncs with Amazon.com. If you are not located in an area with Wi-Fi, you can click Download Now to download the ebook to your computer and then transfer it to your Kindle using USB. Again, library Kindle books will not be delivered using 3G or 4G. You are now ready to enjoy the book. This concludes the tutorial. Please visit Maryland Digital eLibrary Consortium regularly as new titles are always being added. For any additional assistance or questions, please contact your local library.